Hi, welcome to First in Series with Anne, where we talk about the first book in a series and why you should check it out. Today we're going to be talking about a collection put out by the publisher Scholastic, and it's known as their Branches series. So their Branches series is meant for younger readers who are interested in harder books. So I say that, but they're not actually hard. They are very simple short stories that are usually less than 100 pages, and they have this lovely little thing on the spine that says branches. So you can go through our collection and just look for the branches logo on the spine of the book, or you can look for specific books. The first book we're going to talk about is the Owl Diary series by Rebecca Elliott. And this series is written in the style of a diary. So there are short paragraphs followed by pictures or doodles or just something that helps illustrate the story. And so there are a lot of small sections of text as opposed to just lines and lines of text, which makes this great for kiddos who are interested in advancing to chapter books. Next, we have Diary of a Pug. These books are about Bella and her pet dog named Bub. It's just a silly book that's written in the style of a diary with short pieces of text broken up by pictures. And it just kind of tells the story of their relationship and how they want to do things and help each other out. And it's, it's full of a lot of humor and it's a great story. Next, we have Erie Elementary by Jack Shabbard. This is a story about Sam and his friends who discover their elementary school has more than meets the eye. Their school is alive and is trying to eat the students. And it's Sam and his friend's job to figure out how to stop it. This series is silly and fun, and it's great for kids who love adventure stories. The Notebook of Doom series is great for kiddos who love adventure. It's about a young boy who moves to a new town and finds a notebook. In the first book, the images in the notebook start coming to life as balloon creations all over town, and he has to figure out what to do about it. This book is silly and it's a great read for kiddos who are ready to start chapter books on their own. If you like these books and would like other suggestions, please check out the Muncie Public Library YouTube page for other book talks. You can also give us a call in the Youth Services Department and the children's librarians would be more than happy to give you book recommendations over the phone. See you next time.